Short review, The Light Between Oceans. I didn't like this book. Thematically speaking, it was very all over the place. I did see that there was a central theme towards the uh, way that you need to live your life in terms of honesty, but this theme was really spread out thin and it was kind of pushed in one certain direction that didn't really give any succinct answers to the problems. All it did was kind of pull those problems out and kind of show you what happened with those problems. And while that's not exactly a bad thing, I feel like that is very limited compared to what it could have done with this kind of thematic material. And the thematic material is, of course, the main part of the entire book. It's extreme. It's exactly what it's famous for uh, other than the thematic material we do have some decent characters and some decent world building now these allusions to war and these like really war-torn people that have all experienced grief in their lives and loss in their lives uh that's all ties to the theme as well however this does create their own characters which is what i do actually find interesting i do find that each of these characters has a distinct personality except for the main character who is unbelievably boring and i do not think that he has any actual character itself uh, the other characters you might hate them but they have character this main guy does not have character and so you kind of he's, he's like the main guy who's like this brave guy and he's like willing to go down for his wife uh, like it's really not good it's very not good at all so uh, most characters are generally good but the main character just does not pull his own weight and this entire plot line while it does revolve on the themes I feel like it really revolves around the character more and since the main character is the one who's really experiencing most of the brunt of the plot uh, he doesn't really carry his weight these other characters do carry his weight for him and overall because of that it was not a very fulfilling novel because the, the side characters are pulling all the weight and the main character was kind of boring and even though the side characters were pulling all their weight the thematic uh, context of this entire plot is not very well done it was not fully fleshed out and I didn't enjoy it because of that but I'm not just here to roast the book there's one thing I enjoyed quite a bit of the novel it was the actual concept of the plot I, I I thought this was just like really good because I get really, really sappy over these romantic novels and like this, this family novels. Um, and it really, really pulls my heart out every time I see a tragic one like this. And I, I just love that kind of stuff. That kind of just, it just blows my mind every time I see it. Now this wasn't particularly well done because I cannot tell if it's well done. All I can say is I don't feel like it was like better than anything else I've read. Uh, it, it seems average in terms of that sort of genre, but at the same time, man, like it really, really pulled, pulled out my heartstrings. So I will be give, because like it was a well done novel, technically speaking, I'm gonna give it a two stars, but I do think that it needs to be fleshed out in terms of theme and also the characters need to be, the character, most of the characters are fine, just the main character needs to be a lot more characteristic he needs to do something he needs to have his own character instead of just kind of pushing ways past and also being the great guy that will save save his wife yeah, yeah, yeah that like that's that's incredibly boring so that's my review for this book i don't review books like this often so if you don't care you can see uh just see me later that's cool